well, East African countries, plus 256 Uganda, plus 254 Kenya, and uh, plus 255 Tanzania will jointly host the 2027 Africa Cup of Nations, AFCON, under the Pamoja project. Uh, this was announced yesterday in Egypt by CAF president. I must say, this is uh, the biggest story making headlines in East Africa right now. You know, East Africans are very happy and uh, jubilating about this development. Uh, meanwhile, Morocco will host the 2025 edition. Other reports have indicated that uh, Nachivubo Stadium has also been approved to host the 2027 edition of the AFCON. Abazanyi, <laughs> Well, congratulations to East Africa. Otherwise, we can't wait to see African football stars get into the selected East African countries. Well, away from that, you remember the woman who was arrested for stealing a church vehicle at the burial ceremony of the late businessman Apollo Nyigamahe, famously known as Aponye, in Iruchiga district. Uh, she was identified as Shamim Batariro. Yes, yeah, so this woman has been sentenced to 18 months in prison. I think that is uh, one year and uh, six months. She stole a church vehicle. It was a Suzuki registration number UAT478N. Yeah, she was later arrested by Uganda police and uh, finally she's been sentenced to 18 months in prison. I think she will come out in 2026. Yes, that is uh, the latest update coming in from uh, that side. Well, away from that, uh, the Minister for Justice and uh, Constitutional Affairs, Horrible Nobat Mao, has announced that government is pursuing the implementation of mandatory electronic voting for the 2026 elections. Speaking to the media this week, right here in Kampala, Nobat Mao said, This is intended to combat ballot fraud and assure the integrity of free and fair elections. He also revealed that President Museveni is in favor of this idea and encouraged Ugandans to embrace it. However, some Ugandans are saying government is looking for another way to rig elections. I don't know what you make of this. Uh, do you think mandatory electronic voting for the 2026 general elections, according to Nobat Mao and President Museveni, is a good idea or not? The comment section is very open for you. Uh, otherwise, this is uh, the Buzz UG. My name is uh, Melaz Milo, aka Fuller. Subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Don't forget to follow me the other side of TikTok. Um, Melaz Milo, aka Fuller. It is a bye for now. Thank you. Audio jungle.